Good morning. Oh boy. Happy Sunday, the 4th of December. How are you feeling today? Hope you're well. I did not finish my button band last night. Um, I got home a little bit too late and by the time I ate my Mr. Noodles, um, I just didn't have enough juice. I went to bed around 10 and that was it. But alas, I did figure out the Wi-Fi bypass for YouTube. Turns out that it was in the YouTube settings, not in my phone settings. So I watched a video on YouTube last night. Didn't understand a word the guy was saying, but I managed to figure out what he was doing, even though I'm convinced it was in, in fast motion. I figured it out. My episode uploaded in probably 20 minutes instead of 14 hours. Anyway, I'm pretty excited about that. That just means I have way less aggro about these videos. This is my mug for this morning. I used to teach yoga. I just don't have time anymore. So that or the owner of the studio got us all these mugs one year. She used to give great gifts. Hi, Paula, if you're watching. Miss you. <laughs> all right, let's get, let's get a move on. Day four. So Svan um, left a comment in my video from yesterday and she said that the, the gray yarn, which ended up being lilac, <laughs> um, was a colorway by Stranded. So it was called Balloon, which I really like. I love uh, Stranded's yarn. So this is today's color from Svan. I really like it. It looks like um, a variegated, kind of like a barber pulley. It's gonna be nice in my sweater. It's always, it's gonna be nice in my sweater. <laughs> and it's going into the sweater in the order in which I open them. Yesterday I got Friday's colors in and I started yesterday's colors, but then, then the increases started to change and I just didn't have the brain. Like don't have a drink and then try to figure out your knitting pattern. It's, it's bad news. Ask me how I know. So I'm wearing my glasses today so I could read the sticker. And Lorelai left me a message and she said, dude, did you notice that I've been matching the yarn and the stickers? So this is so cute. And this is the yarn. <laughs> I love it. That is a funny one. I really like this color. What is it? Let's see. Skein cocaine, hot socks, hot sock. I love it. That's such a cool name, eh? Skein cocaine. It's very clever. Mmm, yummy. Minty chocolate. I need a, like a little bowl over here on the table. <laughs> oh, I love it. Thank you for the stickers. I'm also eyeballing this from Svan that I'm dying to open, but I'm going to wait. I'm gonna do it on day 15. So I'm very excited this morning. Why am I excited? I can't remember. I have no idea. I was excited for about 10 seconds and now I can't remember. Oh well. I'm wearing my grow shawl again. It's probably one of my favorites because it's so, it's, it's humongous, right? So I love just wrapping myself in it. So the plan for today is uh, I have a couple things I need to do this morning and then I'm going over to the villa to hang out with my dad. Um, I can bring like a simple knitting project, but it needs to be something I can put down pretty easy because he wants me to scratch his back all the time or his arm is paralyzed on the left side. So he can't, when he gets itchy, he can't scratch, poor guy. So. And maybe we'll watch a Christmas movie. Um, what else? Ah, he sleeps a lot too, though. So. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to go knit for a bit while I drink my coffee. I'll be back. By the way, still trying to figure out what I was so excited about earlier.
it it's like it came into my brain and I was really excited about it and it went out just as quickly and I can't figure it out. The cardigan is finished. All I have left to do is to sew on the pockets, weave in the zillion ends, and maybe block it. Do you guys block stuff like stuff like this, like big giant sweaters? I don't know. I kind of feel like it's there's no real purpose to it. Let me know in the comments if you block pieces that are mostly acrylic. This Woolies Thick and Quick is 80% acrylic and 20% wool. Do you guys block that? So before I try to like look presentable so my dad doesn't make fun of me because I haven't brushed my hair. This is where I'm at with the sweater. So this is the second color from Friday. So I'm starting yesterday's color. That was the balloon colorway uh, from Stranded. And then I've got the orange is going to go in. And then I've got the... Oh no! Did I pick the wrong one? No, that is the balloon. <laughs> it's just a big mess in my bag. Then it's going to be this one. And then this one. I'm kind of excited. Hopefully I have some time to make a dent in these minis. Because if I don't, they're going to build up. And I'm going to have a bag full of minis. And I'm going to forget the order that they go in. I'm also entering the yarn room. I'm going to try not to show you guys too much of it. Because... It's a disaster. Um, when I asked my son, we FaceTimed a little bit last week, and I asked him what he wanted for Christmas, and he said he wants socks. So I don't know if I can turn the camera around mid-recording. Nope. So this is kind of the yarn stash. There's a lot more. And then there's some cubes down here. But I need to find some sock yarn for him. But he's really rough. I don't know if like he needs some exfoliation on his feet or he needs to cut his toenails. He says that the socks don't wear in the toes, so it's not because of his toenails. I need to find a hardy sock yarn for him. Here's what I fished out. They're both uh, Regia, Regia, something like that. I'm wondering if I could do stripes. Has anybody ever made striped socks? without cutting the yarn, like not big stripes, just little stripes, micro stripes. What do you, what do you call that? Um, there's a name for it when you do stripes, jogless stripes. I told him not to hold his breath to have socks for Christmas, but I can still get them going because I have to take a break um, on the cardigans because like I said uh, previously, they're that yarn is really heavy, the sweaters are really heavy, and it, I have pain. So the girls and I are getting together on the 15th of December, so I'm hoping that I'll have some time to do it, um, but they also understand that it's not, it's not a quick thing to knit a cardigan. If I give it to them in pieces or half done, they'll understand, they'll get a kick out of it. I'm gonna go get ready now. Before I head out, I just wanted to make this tiny envelope. I ordered one of these punch things um, from Amazon, but it won't arrive until probably next weekend. So this is my friend Nancy's. Um, I don't have like a cutter, so I use my fabric cutter. I know that's probably bad and I'll have to buy a new blade, but stay tuned. Look how cute this is. I can hardly stand it. It's a teeny weeny. I'm going to be addicted. I'm going to make all the paper things. So we'll only check in for today. I'm wearing the same socks as yesterday. Because I only had them on for a few hours. For those of you who think it's gross. This is the Skull Maker. I think that's how you say it. By Fiber Tales. And I knit it out of the Retrosaria something Donegal. I bought it from... Uh, Rosa Pomar in, in the Portugal. And I love this yarn. It's a uh, tweedy, kind of, sort of, dimensional. It's got flecks of all kinds of different colors. And I have worn the crap out of this sweater. Um, I brought it to Europe with me last year and I literally just rotated between three sweaters in four weeks. 
We did laundry, don't worry. I literally had a carry-on for four weeks in Europe. It was bomb, because you didn't have to carry around a bunch of luggage. And we traveled a lot, we hopped a lot. Just getting ready to head out and there are no down trees. So I'm really happy about that because I was worried about that wind yesterday. It was insanely strong. And I was sure I was gonna lose some trees because I usually do when the wind is that bad. Um, I'm also wearing my, these are a type of selbu mitten. I know they're a skein deer design. I'll put it in the description box, um, which pattern it is. And I remember the yarn is a lichen and lace. I think she's local-ish but all the info will be down in the description, okay? I just got home and realized that I turned the furnace off this morning while I was recording and I forgot to turn it back on. Looks like I'm wearing my coat in the house for a little bit because it's freezing. Wow. I also really have to pee, but I don't want to go because I'm afraid of how cold the seat's gonna be. I just sat down a little while ago. It's a uh, quarter to eight and I can't keep my eyes open. I don't even know. I don't know what's going on. I am ready to go for work tomorrow. I did some meal prepping, made myself some dinner. Eric sent me home with spaghetti sauce last night. So that's what I had for supper. And I had enough leftovers for my lunch tomorrow. So I'm gonna knit a little bit more, but I wanted to update you on the sweater. It's, um, this is balloon right here and that's the orange. I can't remember what it was called. I'm sorry, Lorelai. Um, and then I started today's colors. So I'm gonna try to finish at least the first one of today's. And then, anyway, that's gonna be it for me for tonight because I wanna go to bed soon and I can't imagine I'm gonna do anything interesting between now and then. <laughs> so I'll see you in the morning. Bye.